Making simple syrup and adding it to your cakes is super easy. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to make three different flavors of simple syrup. If you're new to my channel and wanna learn more about cake decorating, subscribe for more tips and tutorials. Now let's get started. To make simple syrup, we'll need water, granulated sugar, and our flavorings, cocoa powder, vanilla extract, and almond extract. We'll also need a saucepan, whisk, and a plastic condiment bottle with lid. I like to use clear tape and permanent marker to label the bottle with the flavor inside. Let's start with the base syrup for the vanilla and almond flavors. The exact ingredients are listed in the description below. We start by adding two cups of water to the saucepan. One cup of water per flavor. Next, we add sugar to the water. We're going to add in two cups of sugar. One cup per flavor. Next, I whisk it around a bit. Then I heat the sugar water mixture to a rapid boil over medium high heat for about four minutes. This is our base syrup. Remove the saucepan from the heat and let the base syrup come to room temperature. I like to transfer the syrup to a large measuring cup. This spout helps me pour the simple syrup into the bottles later. Here I have my vanilla and almond extract. Once the base syrup is at room temperature, I pour half of the syrup into the bottle. Next, I add one tablespoon of vanilla directly into the bottle and replace the top. You can see here that the vanilla sits on top of the syrup. I give that a little bit of a shake to fully mix the vanilla extract into the syrup. Next, I repeat the steps with the almond. Again, adding one tablespoon of almond extract before replacing the top and giving the bottle a nice shake. And here we have our vanilla and almond syrups. Super easy. Next, we're gonna make our chocolate simple syrup. In the saucepan, I pour in one cup of water, one cup of sugar, and finally, two tablespoons of cocoa powder. Next, I whisk until it's mostly combined, and again, I'll place it onto the cooktop to rapidly boil. Because the cocoa powder does contain a bit of dairy, you'll want to keep an eye on the saucepan to make sure that it doesn't boil over. Now I remove the saucepan from the heat and let the syrup come to room temperature. Once it's cooled, we pour the syrup into the measuring cup. Our final step is to add one teaspoon of vanilla extract. I give that a little bit of a whisk in the measuring cup and then I pour the chocolate syrup into the bottle. And here we have our chocolate simple syrup. All of these syrups can be stored in the refrigerator for up to two weeks. These bottles make it easy to pour the simple syrup over your cakes. You can also use a pastry brush to add syrup to your cakes for extra moisture. Be mindful not to oversaturate your cake with syrup. If you enjoyed this video, let me know by hitting the like button below. To learn more about cake decorating, subscribe to my channel for more tips and tutorials. As always, thanks for watching.